Uh, in this video, I'm going to give you a quick update on the weather situation in the Hulihan and Sha'alam area. And this is specifically going to be uh, pictures and videos from the Blue Lagoon Resort, which is about six miles north of Hulihan, closer to Bangkok, and about 19 miles south of Sha'alam. And so as you can see from the video here, it is consistently raining all day, all night long. Um, in addition to you know, some dam issues um, north of Thailand and, and coming down from China. So this is probably just going to get worse. And uh, here's another. So that video is actually looking south. The ocean's to the left. That's looking south towards Huahin Town. Uh, this video is looking to the north. And uh, this is from the third floor. And you're looking towards the Radisson Blue Hotel. And the CM Beach Resort is to the right of that, closer to the ocean. And as you can see, this car is struggling to uh, go down that side road. So this flooded about 10 years ago, uh, pretty much cut it off. It was so deep um, and it's looking like if this uh, continues, it may uh, do the same this year. Um, threw in a picture of my cat. Cat's name is Meow Kiao. I didn't name her, but uh, awesome cat. And she seems to be enjoying the rain. And this last video is from about an hour ago, which would be around um, 8.30 a.m. Pacific time. Uh, today on the 11th, and this is the main road that you take from Bangkok to get to Sha'an and then eventually Hua Hin. And as you can see, there's standing water there. So this was sent to me in a video format, but uh, for some reason I can't pour it into this. Uh, but if you can, hopefully you can see this clearly enough that it looks like there's two or three inches of standing water in the middle of the road and off to the side, it's starting to you know get eight, 10 inches deep where it slopes down. And again, this is getting worse. So if you're flying into Bangkok or you're going to travel to Hua Hin in the next couple of days or the next couple of weeks, you want to be uh, very up to date on what's happening there. And again, I was told that if you're staying in Sha'am um, or anywhere north of Hua Hin that, and you're on the first floor, you're going to want to check, make sure that there's not going to be any potential flooding issues.